Hello viewers, this is Vet0121 and welcome back to Final Fantasy 7 Hardcore Remix. You know who's responsible for North Coral winding up like this. Uh, yeah. yeah apparently it's Barrett's fault. Wonder if that'll get explained eventually. Oh. If I had a buggy, I'd cross the southern desert and go to that town across the river. Hmm. Buggy, huh? Well, that might be nice to have. Next train's coming in soon. Oh, okay. What the hell? How come I can't move right now? What the hell? Oh. God, I say, jeez, what the hell was going on there? Must be some kind of glitch. Um, yeah, let's talk to this guy. And I don't care about his story. He's just gonna sit there and whine about stuff. Oh, okay, we can buy Maiden's Kisses here and Cornucopias. And they cure Frog and Mini. So, yeah, I might as well get a few of those. Might come in handy. And here at the weapon sh or the item shop, it's not even, yeah, it's not even a, a good shop. It's a pretty crappy one. And we can actually buy a force stealer here. Of course, I'm not going to buy one because I already have one. But if you didn't get one at Junin or Junon or whatever it's called, then you can buy one there to hell with the Mako react. Apparently these people in this town hate Mako reactors, I guess. wonder what that's all about. Yeah, I wouldn't know. Really? I saw a big one on the arm of a young guy heading towards the ropeway. That, blig cl that big... Blah, that black cloak he had on was really cool. Okay. If you say so. Um, yeah, I might as well go to the inn here. Yeah, this is the inn. Yeah. Well, if we go all the way down here and head to the right, we can actually leave town, but I do not want to do that. I want to actually head here to the left, because this will take us to the gold saucer. Barrett, what happened? Sorry. Alright, what are you sorry for, man? What happened? My hometown used to be around here. What do you mean, used to? It ain't here no more. Heard it got buried in just four years. But how could those people say those terrible things? And it's my fault. All my fault. Oh, okay. Apparently this is what Coral used to look like, I guess. Maybe dusty and poor, but it's calm. It's a really small town. It's the first time I ever heard Mako Reactor mentioned. Okay. What are we gonna do? The only one opposed to this is dying. I'm definitely against it, no matter what. There's nothing to talk about if you're thinking of throwing away our coal. Hmm. Our coal's been ours for generations. Our fathers and theirs before them risked their lives for it. We have no right to throw it all away so easily. But listen, Dyne, no one uses coal nowadays. It's a sign of the times. Right, everything is Mako now. It'll be all right, Dine. Dine Schindler Incorporated will guarantee your livelihood once a Mako reactor is completed. I don't want my wife Myrna to suffer anymore. Okay. What is she sick? Yep. Pretty much everybody's against Dine, I guess.
That's how the coral reactor was built and completed. Y'all thought it would bring us an easier life. Whoa. Happened when Dine and I were out of town for a few days. Hmm. Coral was burned down by Shinra troops. Oh, that can't be good. What, they burned down the friggin' bar too? What a bunch of bastards. Man. Shinra troops, what for? There was an explosion at a reactor. Shinra blamed the accident on the people, said it was done by a rebel faction. Yeah, it's pretty fucked up. Oh, it's alright, Barrett. Don't blame yourself. We were all fooled by the promises the Shinra made back then. That's why, that's why I get so pissed off! Not only did they take advantage of me, but I lost my wife, Myrna, too. Hmm. Hey everyone, if you want to go on the gold saucer, hurry and get on. Yep, alright. Dime was my best friend. We were close ever since we were kids. I never knew. Barrett never said a thing. Eris has nothing to say. Red 13 has nothing to say. And Yuffie's gonna be a little bitch by saying he, she doesn't feel sorry for Barrett. Wow. Another reason why I hate that character. Yep, let's get on. Wow. Hell, man. It's like a floating Disneyland, except not. I've never actually been to Disneyland. <laughs> so yeah, maybe I'm just talking out of my ass there, but... Something like that, I guess. Been to Six Flags. Okay, we got some fat chocobo over here. Welcome to the Gold Saucer. Alright. Welcome to the Gold Saucer. Are you together? A single pass is 3,000 gil, or you can purchase a lifetime pass for 30,000 gil. Yeah, actually, I think I will pay the 30,000 gil. That way I don't have to pay again. Alright, very nice. Here at the Gold Saucer, there are many places where you must pay with GP. Just think of GP as money that you can only use at the Gold Saucer. GP can only be redeemed at the games in the Wonder Square and at the Chocobo races. GP limit is 10,000, so be careful. Alright. Wow, let's have fun. I know this isn't the right time to do this. Hey Barrett, cheer up! I ain't no cheery mood, so just leave me alone. Yeah, this is... Eris is kind of funny in this part. You 
Nah, nah. Not really. Of course! We're just gonna forget all about what Barrett just told us. We're gonna go play. <laughs> so play! Mess around all you want! Don't forget we're after Sephiroth. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, that's funny. I think he's mad. You think? He'll be fine. He seems to be doing a little better now. Well, anyways. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go with Tifa here. Because I don't know if that affects affection points or not, but whatever. And can we do anything here in the event square? Oh, there's no show right now. Okay. Well, whatever. And let's explore a little bit here. Oh, who's this guy? Can we talk to him? Oh, boy. Who are you talking to, man? Huh. My name's Cloud, and stop calling me boy. <laughs> I'm the owner of the Gold Saucer. The name's Dio. Just call me Dio. Alright, man. Will do. By the way, boy, do you know what a black materia is? Uh, no. Now, what is it? Ah ha ha, that, I say, that's a good one, boy, but it's not good to lie, you can't fool me. No, seriously, I don't know what a freaking black materia is. Well, a while back, a boy your age came in and asked me if I had black materia. Thought you might know who he was, seeing as how you're both the same age. Did he happen to have a black cloak? Why, yes, yes indeed and a tattoo on his hand that said number one. Where did he go? Ha ha ha, I have no idea. <laughs> well, thanks. Thanks, man. I say, stop by the battle arena if you like, boy. You'll probably like it. Many of my collections are on display there. Oh, alright. Okay, man. Um... Yeah, let's head to the Wonder Square now, I guess. Whoa. Hey you, what are you looking so down for? How about it? Want me to read your fortune? A bright for future? A happy future? Oh, but don't hold it against me if that doesn't come true. Okay. Oh, so sorry, I'm a fortune-telling machine. The names... And... This, ladies and gentlemen, is the most worthless character in the game, and his name is Kate Sith. Yeah, he's worthless. I'm pretty sure that everyone knows that. You can only read the future? You kidding? I can find missing things, missing people, anything. Then can you tell me where a man named Sephiroth is? Sephiroth, right? Okay, here goes. Okay. Ordinary luck. It will be an act of fortune. Given to the good will of others and something big will happen after summer. Wait, hold on. Huh? Let me try again. <laughs> what? what? the hell, man? What kind of a fortune teller do you call yourself? Careful of forgetfulness. Your lucky color is blue? <laughs> you spitting out fortune cookies at us? Wait, wait, give me another chance. Let me try it again. Okay, man. Whatever. What the? What does it say? What you pursue will be yours, but you will lose something dear. I don't know if it's good or bad. This is the first time I ever got something like this. Then shall we? Excuse me? Being a fortune teller, this is gonna bug me. If 
I don't see it turns out how it turns out, I'll never be able to relax, so I'm going with you. Is it alright, Cloud? I'm coming with you no matter what you say. And that's all for this episode of Final Fantasy VII Hardcore Remix. In the next episode, we will explore more of the Gold Saucer. This is Veteran Owen 21 and I'll see you next time.